Hello YouTube, I'm back and with another unboxing, but you can't really call it an unboxing because it's not in a box. But anyway, you'll see why later. Um, I must say that this will be the most exciting unboxing packaging you will watch. It won't be boring at all, I'm so excited. This product came from China and it's going to save me a lot of trouble and it's just super exciting you can't I can't wait it's just so good let's get into it okay let's get into it I'm just gonna rip this thing open out of here. Hmm. All right. I ordered two of these. Uh, one for my bathroom and one for get out of here. One for my kitchen. Okay. So what we have here is a very exciting thing and I'm so excited to have. I was tired of my soap always getting all screwed up in the water and slimy and making ugly looking things on my countertops but um, hopefully these will work out. These are on eBay and let's open this one. If I can get it open. Alright. Trash off my desk. Alright, so let's see. Alright, there they are. So the idea is it kind of leans forward like a waterfall. Well, they're actually called the Plastic Bathroom Kitchen Waterfall Drain Soap Dish or Sponge Holders with suction cup box so as you can see two suction cups on the back end probably will help to tilt forward a little bit these bars extend upward so the soap stays in the dish and the water drains down all the soap scum junk and um, so it's pretty basic, you know, it's, it's nothing special like I said, but I'm very excited. I am very excited to use these in my kitchen and in my bathroom, which is very blue. Alright, so the the reason I got the orange one is, is figured there was no other color that would go with my kitchen besides orange. It was the closest thing. It's probably like the ugliest looking thing, but... I'm so excited. I'm gonna go and do a review and a before and after, and I will return. Okay, so here we are in my bathroom. Um, as you can see, look at that mess. I had a soap saver, which I got from Dollar Tree. Mm. And look at this disgust. Something that I hate. So I ended up putting the soap up here and look at the slime. And ugh, it just slimer from Ghostbusters or something's been in here, guys. So I have to clean all this off. Anyway, I'm going to tilt this as the edge. Look at that. That is beautiful thing. That is that is a thing of beauty. It just it just has the curved edge there, so it fits perfectly in my little seashell sink. And we're gonna just press the suction cups on. Take our soap. Let's put some water on the soap, and then we'll see what happens. Let's see if this is truly. 
I'm just gonna put water in here and see where it goes. Oh, look at the waterfall go. No more bad soap scums. Very uh, genius product here. Um, would like it if it was ceramic or, you know, but hey, hey it's cool. But um, let's go to the kitchen now. Okay, YouTubers, I'm back, and as you can see, I used to have a soap dish in here, the black one that was in the bathroom. Um, doesn't work, just fills with water, it's just a cheap thing. And look at all that water back there. It's just, it's just a mess. And then even these little soap savers, it still gets, as you can see, it's like, look, just getting like slime so hopefully these things will work and look underneath it's just well, these these are good idea but I like the new thing so let me let me clean this up this time and um, we'll put the new one to test in the in the kitchen and I'm hoping that the curve of it now see this is all soap scum I'll have to come in here with some cleaner later, but I just want to give you a quick clean up there. So we'll put this to test in the kitchen. Alright, I might have to just keep it curved a little bit there. Or go totally in the caddy corner it. Looks pretty cool a little bit. Alright, there was a suction cup down. Alright, let's pop our soap in. Actually, let's put some water on the soap first again. Get all the slime off of it. Right. Put the soap into the dish. I'm back. Um, for some reason, camera shut off on my phone. All right. I um, put the soap in. Get it wet again so you can see. There's a waterfall effect. See the water come right out. Drip some water all over into it in the back there. And. Let's let it drip for a second. Get a real close up. And see how much water stays behind. Yeah, it's pretty good. It drains really well. Um, highly recommend these things. Um, so, we did the review of these. Um, they seem fine. And I will go back to my computer. Okay. Alright, I'm going to add a little something to this video. Um, we're going to check and see how it works with a sponge. Alright, so, got my sponge here. I'm going to get a lot of water in there. We're just going to go put it in there. If it says, it is also for sponges. So. what happens here it's starting to come out I didn't touch it yet I don't want this water but yeah I squeeze it I'll push it all the way to the back and squeeze it too so you have the waterfall effect going so eventually I'll do it again I want to see if the sponge will just eventually give us some water out of there sponge Very cool, very good. I really like this thing. Sponge would end up drying, but let's see here when you got the soap in there and the sponge. We'll save it. All right. Oh, YouTube. I hope you enjoyed that. It was a lot of fun for me. And it was just too much excitement. I mean, I don't even know. But it was good. It was great. I am. Wow. Oh. What do 
I do next after that? Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and if you'd like to subscribe, or like, or comment, or make fun of me, or whatever you want to do, just do it. It's all in good fun. It's time for me to go. Take care, YouTube, and all the best. Cheers with my green tea. Mm. Goodbye.